Welcome to our coding tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many Java developers encounter. Our viewer is looking to create a map that holds activities and their total durations, especially when those activities appear multiple times with varying durations. Let's break down the challenge. The viewer has a list of monitored data, each containing an activity and its duration. They want to aggregate these durations into a single map where each activity is associated with its total duration. While they have a working solution using a traditional loop, they're eager to implement this using Java Streams. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your questions, answering them, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully you'll find that solution you're looking for. Now, let's continue on to the video. To sum the durations of activities using Java Streams, we will utilize the Collectors class. First, we need to group the data by activity. Next, we will collect the durations for each activity. Instead of counting, we will sum the durations using a custom collector. Now let's put it all together in a single stream operation. We will collect the results into a map where the key is the activity name and the value is the total duration. Finally, let's review the complete code snippet. This will give you a clear view of how to implement the solution. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To sum a duration field from a stream in Java, use the three argument version of the two map collector. This allows you to collect activities and their durations efficiently. Java 8 introduced useful features to the map interface, including the merge method. This lets you simplify your code, making it cleaner than using a traditional for loop. And that's it guys. I hope this video has helped find that solution that you're looking for. And if it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until the next time that you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Okay.